People often ask me, what is the Renegades? It's a really difficult one to describe actually. The Renegades is quite a complicated collection of ideas, but this is basically going to be a summing up of what the Renegades are now, what we're doing in summer, what the Renegades is going to turn into. So where, where we're going and what we're kind of leading towards. So yeah, part one. What is the Renegades? What is the Renegades? What is the Renegades? Um, I suppose the best way to describe the Renegades would be with one word, call it a movement. That kind of encapsulates everything. There's people involved in it. Uh, anyone can be a part of the Renegades. Anyone. Um, and there's also an idea behind it, something, something that we want to happen. Without sounding too cliche, we want to teach people how to live life to the full. There's a few fundamental themes with the Renegades and we touch on a lot of philosophy. Uh, we like to kind of expand our minds and think as deeply as possible. We're all about learning stuff. And I kind of feel that in the way the world is today, there's, there's some fundamental things that we miss out on, like real just human things that we don't get to learn. And I wanna kind of bridge that gap with the Renegades. Those things include um, stuff like survival, also uh, like self-defense, wanna teach you a lot of that. Stuff like meditation and spirituality. Meditation is an absolute key to life. And we're not taught about it in school. I mean, it blows my mind. It's one of the reasons I hated school is because Nothing seems to have any kind of purpose and it's a real shame because it's, it's the time in your life where you are the best at learning and yet none of it seems to matter. It's all, it's all seems so meaningless. It's like one big party uh, held at a venue that no one really wants to be at and no one really cares about what they're doing. It's such a waste of time. All right, I suppose if I was going to sum up what the Renegades is um, it is a struggle because there's it touches on so many different subjects i've got to define it on what it isn't i've got the the dictionary definition of of a renegade up here and it says a person who deserts or betrays an organization country or set of principles now that isn't just what the renegades encapsulate there is a, a kind of rebel side to it but it's a rebel with a cause and what the renegades is is taking what this society and this system this set of rules that we live by and learning everything we can and squeezing everything we can out of that and then taking it to the next level that's what we want to do i've always been about that but i think that's that's kind of what the renegades is we want to transcend the normal way of life. Learning as many skills as we can and experiencing as much as we can. I feel like we just, we miss out on so much these days. And it's, it's such a shame because the world has so much to offer and your life has so much to offer. But we just miss out on a lot. All right, part two. The walk. I haven't explained what the Renegades is. This summer we have a very exciting thing planned. It's like, uh, it's kind of like what the Messy Heads did, which um, is, is an awesome uh, movement as well in the same kind of sense. Um, they kind of went on a road trip uh, around America and they spoke to loads of people and they met a load of people and they kind of spread their, their revolution that they were spreading. They, they, they spread it around and it was amazing. I love what they did. It made so much sense. I've always loved the idea of like survival and I've always loved um, getting out of my comfort zone that that is my comfort zone out of my comfort zone is my comfort zone does that make sense? does that make sense? I don't care maybe it does if any of you have seen Into the Wild or read it then you kind of know what I mean or if any of you are aware of uh, a photographer called Mike Brody who's an absolute god Mwah. wonderful man um, then you'll kind of be able to have a more tangible grasp on what we're doing. So in short, what we're doing is walking from 
London to Athens. But the kind of catch is we're starting with no money whatsoever. And this is for a few reasons. Number one, we want to prove to people that you don't need loads of money to be able to travel because you miss out on so much by not traveling. And I feel like the biggest barrier for a lot of people is the money barrier. And it's it's a real, it's, a, it's such a shame that people miss out on that. It, it can change your lives. Um, and we want to prove that you can travel with little money by starting with no money. Um, and hopefully um, people will see that. Um, and number two, we want to meet people. So the slogan of uh, the Renegades is come find me. And the idea behind that is through our videos, we're going to do lots of uh, how-to videos along the way. We're going to be saying, showing you like how to light fires um, when you're traveling, uh, how to talk to people when you're in different countries, uh, how to build the camp, what you need to take with you to travel the way we're traveling. And basically, we're going to be making the mistakes so you don't have to. And what we want, and if this happens, I'll know that I've succeeded, I'll know that the renegades have succeeded. If we're out doing our thing, we're traveling, we're somewhere in the middle of nowhere, and someone, some awesome, awesome person who has learned from everything that we've posted on, on YouTube or Instagram or through our blog, they've learned and they've got up, they've stuck a backpack on and they've come and found us. Then I'll know I've succeeded. And yeah, and so then the future of the Renegades is this movement and we just want it to grow. We want to inspire as many people as we possibly can to live the life that is really calling them, that fundamental feeling, that thing that just excites you more than anything. So for me, it is traveling and it's traveling in a rough sense. So we're camping rough, we're not staying in hotels. I love it. I just love it, lighting my own fires, cooking my own food on the fires. Uh, it's just, it's always pulled me. And I wanna show people that they can do that as well. The Renegades is gonna become kind of a, a giant encyclopedia, in instruction manual for you lot, how, how to do it how to get there and how to kind of like tune your mind to accept your actual path because we all have an actual path we all have a defined purpose deep down we know what it is but through the way the society works might not necessarily feel tangible for you my purpose is fucking is building camps and when you're like a kid, that's that's fine. You can you can go ahead, build as many camps as you want. But as you reach the age of twenty, that kind of starts to become a little bit less accepted. Uh, <laughs> and I wasn't cool with that. I like building my camps. I enjoy it. I enjoy it when people enjoy my camps. And it's a shame to be told that you're too old to do something because age is just a construct is something we've invented on the whole the renegades it's an idea an idea that anyone can change the world so why not you and why not me Yeah. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope to see you one day. Maybe you will come find me. I had to get it in there somewhere. Thank you. Thank you for watching. I can't wait. I'm very excited. Things things are starting to happen and it's it's getting very, very scary, but in such a good way. My adrenal gland is going off on one at the moment. Adrenaline is pumping around my body faster than I can think. I'm excited.
If you're watching this and you want to find out more about the Renegades, go to go to my Instagram. I'll put a link in the description, or uh, go to my website. Just type in Harvey Press on Google, and you should find um, my website that will say Bad Team to Ballroom Queen Harvey Press. Um, go on that, or just type in. Uh, renegadebay.co.uk I'll link it in the description as well go follow us on Instagram because that's kind of that's the that's become the fundamental like backbone of it all um, somehow 